Oh, welcome to Monticello Ecological Park entrance. Hours are from dawn till dusk. I'm going to walk up here and so y'all can see the map. Now this is the first time I'm using this video camera, so you're going to have to bear with us. Welcome to another episode of Retired Backyard Burgers. We're approaching the main entrance to the trail. It's a beautiful area. We're going to do our best to get some park benches put down here and maybe a picnic table if we're able to. I just got to find out who we got to contact and see if they'll allow us to raise the funds to do it. Or maybe they'll just go ahead and put the equipment in here. There's been a little vandalism which we noticed the last time we were here when we were cleaning things up. Sadly, some of the things are got spray paint on them, I guess. And now we're going to get on the old boardwalk. Which looks like we need to come down and do a little bit more cleaning again. It is a beautiful area. Wood.
as I say, this is the first time I'm using this video camera, and I don't see too well, so I'll do the best video I can for you all. We're coming to the end of our walkway, and soon we'll be on the natural path. Beautiful afternoon. Things may move a little slower now since the terrain is about to change. And I'm handing the camera over to Shondell. I will follow up close behind her so I don't get injured walking the pathway. Go ahead, sweetheart. You got it. As you can see, there are many, many trees in here. I can't identify all of them, although they do have signs up to identify some of them. This area is a secretly known hot spot for birds. Early spring, midsummer, early fall, even during the winter. This is a white oak. As you can tell, the path is a little dangerous for blind people or those with very low vision. However, it's a beautiful walk, well worth it. We've been here quite a few times now learning the pathways, learning where to walk and where not to. Here we have a live oak. Here you can go left or you can go right. Which way would you like to go today? 
Let's go to the left. We have butterflies out here. Turned out to be a beautiful day. Not too hot. It's really a relief after the hot summer we've had. As you can hear, there's a slight breeze. Spanish moss hanging from the trees. The path is a mixture of rocks and plants and dirt. And of course, tree stumps, roots, and a lot of fallen leaves. Well, see, this would be a perfect spot to put a bench, a place where you could sit, catch your breath, soak in, and enjoy some of nature. But as you see, there's, there's no benches, there's no place to sit. And we're going to try and change that. We have retired backyard birders of Monticello, Florida. We have a water hickory. And over here would be a nice spot for a picnic table. I believe we're at the open side of it.
sorry about the delay, just trying to get some equipment situated. You be careful here, looks like we have some fallen limbs. This area is not quite wheelchair accessible yet. <laughs> we don't know what the good Lord's got in store for our little park. Here we have a mockernut hickory. I'm glad they at least label some of the trees, otherwise I'd be lost. Here we have American holly. Coming to a bend in the road here, or path, I should say. Right behind you. Stay close so you don't fall and get hurt. I am right behind you. Coming to the end of this little path, looks like we're going to start on another one, which we have another little walkway to walk across. We will be going on to the Blue Trail. This is the beginning of the path, our little walkway. This one has no hand railings on it, so we will have to be extra careful. Okay. And here we have a slice pine. Stay right behind me, don't get too close to the edge. Um, pretty much in the middle, I think.
looks like we need to clean the leaves off of this one. Do a little panning around so you can see all the trees that are out here, vines, different plants. We have a slight turn here, you, so you be careful. We're coming to the end of this walkway. Now we're on a gravel path. And another little walkway here. I suppose at one time there was a little bit of water in here, but our summer has been very dry. There's very little rain. into this little walkway, back onto the gravel and the dirt. Another walkway. This one has side rails on it. Always makes it a little bit easier for those that have very little sight or are blind. Here we have a little bit of water. Looks like it's flowing just a wee bit. A lot of sand. And I have a little water on this side. Breeze feels good. have ferns growing out here.
coming to another walkway, a little bridge. No handrails on this one. But as long as we're careful, we'll be all right. Well, I don't think they had visually impaired people in mind when they mapped all this out. But that's okay. It is a joyful walk. And if you love nature, wildlife, this is where you need to be. Here we have a sweet gum tree. And a sycamore. Looks like he's been here a while. Coming to another walkway. This one has handrails. You see, he brought his mobility cane with him today. Makes it easier walking. Broom this coming weekend. Well, there's no rain. We'll get this stuff cleaned up. Well, as many walkways and bridges that we have, it'll have to be a cool day in order to get all of it done in one day. Well, we live kind of close, so we can do it over a few days, a weekend maybe. Let's see how it goes. I hear a woodpecker. The zebra butterfly just flew in front of me. I don't know if I caught it on camera. Woodpecker just flew by. Let's see if we can catch him. He's in that tree ahead of me. I'm sure you can hear him. Come to another fork in the road. Here we have an eastern red bud. pan over here where we have a southern magnolia we just came off of the blue trail now we're headed to the red trail if I remember correctly, the blue trail goes further to the right, and the red trail goes to the left, so name your poison. Now, uh, looks like we're going on the red trail. 
<laughs> this would be another great area for uh, a bench, picnic table, place where you could rest, enjoy nature. For you sighted folks, take in some scenery. Love it out here. It is beautiful. Here we have a tulip poplar. This one feels like a, another type of magnolia. I'm not sure. That could be. More butterflies flying around. Not too sure if we can get them in the film, though. You can see how he uses his mobility cane to see where he's going to fill things out. Don't let me go off the path. I might not end up home for a couple weeks. <laughs> well, I'm be sure I come back and find you. <laughs> Dilapidated, right? Here we have a couple of old benches that look like they've been here since the beginning of time. That's why we need some new ones. Is that the old exercise equipment over here? It does look like it. Yeah, that stuff needs to be replaced. But next time we're out, we'll come clean it out so you can get to it. A lot of stuff overgrown, I guess. Yes. So far, the path is fairly easy to walk along. Yeah, I'm falling down today. Here's a little better description of a tulip poplar. As you can see, the red trail is marked by red paint on top of the post. Looks like we're coming up on a wall along across the path. That's going to make our path a little narrower. Stay to my left, straight ahead. You can come towards me a little bit. That should be perfect. Looks like we have another path headed off this direction. It's not marked, so I'm not sure which path it is. Now, as you can see, we're coming up to a nice open area. 
There would be nice picnic tables. You know, benches. Benches. Water fountain, maybe. Porta potties. Make it really accessible for everybody. Have a squirrel up ahead of us. He might show up. See if we can capture these little purple flowers. People would probably call them a weed, but flowers are flowers and they're part of nature. Looks like we have some more exercise equipment over here. But as you can see, this is all open in here. another red post. So, do we continue to follow the red trail? Or do we go forward for a little bit? Let's continue to go forward for a little bit. See what else is up here. Another little open area. Another exercise benches. Picnic table. It's been here wow. for quite a while. Looks like it might still be solid. Maybe. I don't know. Don't know if I'd trust it. No, I'm not going to sit down on it. Get a new one. That's the only one. Still a beautiful area, you know. It's yes, nice, it is. It's open, fresh air. We can't beat that. The birds sing. The squirrels play. The snakes slither. Butterflies split. And the spiders jump. Some more exercise equipment here. Looks like we're still on the red trail. Our trail slopes here, so we have to be careful walking. Step over. Trail is sloping down to the left. A bird on the branch ahead of us. Perhaps we caught him. In this little tree up here. Beautiful. And our walk comes to an end. And that was the 
Ecological Park here in Monticello, Florida. I hope you enjoyed the tour. We'll try to do a better video next time we come out. Thank you for watching. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe. And if you're watching this on Twitter, please remember to follow us. We're the Retired Backyard Birders. Thank you, and good day.